The 2023 Jimmy and Rosalind Carter work project is returning to Charlotte and WCNC is a proud partner. Their focus an affordable housing development near the airport with 39 new single family homes. The first week of October volunteers from WCNC Charlotte and all over will come together to build more than 20 of those homes in one week. Until then, we're sharing how the Carter Work Project is seeking solutions to the affordable housing problem in Charlotte. I am a single mom of Bailey. She's uh, 15 years old. LaPree Holmes is a soon to be homeowner. Wait, I'm thinking either here mm -hmm. or here is going to be where the TV is going to go. For the very first time, and she's definitely hands on. I applied to be part of the Habitat um, Homeownership Program and and after that, we did a lot of volunteer hours. I've literally been here almost every day that we built on my home. So I put in all of the blood, the sweat, and the tears to ensure that my house is built um, in this community. Habitat for Humanity will be building that community in West Charlotte, a $10.6 million development with 39 homes called the Meadows at Plato Price named after the all-black grade school that once stood there. For CEO Laura Belcher, building affordable housing in the area is her top goal. It's really a challenge. Uh, in Charlotte, the need for housing is immense. We have a multi-year backlog, uh, a pipeline of applicants that are qualified and ready for housing. Uh, we're just trying to build as fast as we can. For LaPree, it's a dream come true. I feel proud to be able to have a home that um, to provide shelter for me and for Bailey and to even leave that legacy to her. I think it's really important because we're anchoring affordable home ownership into a part of the community that does not have a lot of ownership options. By doing that, we, we will bring families that will be here for uh, years and generations. They'll raise their children here. Uh, they will be anchors to this community. LaPree's daughter, Bailey, excited as well. It feels great. Um, can't wait to have my own room and design it. I mean, somewhere I can be safe and um, just be myself with my family. Her mother overjoyed to give her a place called home. Home means um, family. Home is like happy. It's our safe haven and it's peaceful. We'll have more stories like LaPree's as we approach the big build in early October. Among the celebrities who will be here in Charlotte to lend their voices and their muscles, Garth Brooks and Trisha Yearwood. And if you want to join in on the efforts to help make a difference, visit our website, WCNC.com. You'll find a link to this story along with ways you can volunteer with Habitat. So the Carter Work Project hasn't been here in Charlotte since 1987. We had a group from this station in 80, back and in volunteered went out there. That's the first time I ever saw Jimmy Carter. He came to actually then came to the other station back in the early 2000s. Came by. Wow. So, yeah. so the Carters yeah. have kind of yeah. given this now to um, Garth Brooks people. and Trisha Yearwood, and they're going to be out here and they're going to be getting to work too. I think I told you a story about Jimmy Carter. He, came, he was in the building. I'm, not, I'm remember when he was here, Ben. It was a few years back. Uh, was I? I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe it was a little bit before this. that. But he was interviewed yeah. by uh, one of our anchors at the time. But he came in the studio with a with Secret Service agent. He walked over to me, <laughs> put his hand and said, Hi, my name is Jimmy Carter. <laughs> <laughs> and you're Carter. like, oh, my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, he has an incredible legacy, that's Without for sure.